Well, hey there, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Adam. Thanks for hanging out with me today. And today is going to be another quick one. This is the run video of the KO Show Optima, or Turbo Optima, sorry. Um, so if you guys didn't see kind of the finale of that one or any of the build videos, you know, I'll link at least the build video kind of finale up here when we revealed the color of it and everything. But it's a bone stock um, Turbo Optima. Um, I have a Element 19 turn single um, motor in it. Hobby Wing 1060 ESC and the only other upgrade is the carbon fiber top deck um, which unfortunately you can't see too much of it but if you look through the window you can see some nice carbon bling in there but I'm not going to talk let's take it out for a drive and unless something blows up that's going to wrap it up for today All right, we interrupt this run video with some unfortunates. Now, didn't wreck the car, didn't break the car, but when I was out there running, I was running two different cars at the same time, this and the Pegasus. And, you know, I'm running in two different locations. I ran this one first and it drove great out in the yard. Now, I went to the track, but before I did so, I turned on the Pegasus and ran it around. Now, the problem with the Pegasus is it has a 1060 ESC and I just have the switch mounted to the ESC itself and just leave it on because I don't want to keep taking the body on and off, but there's no good way to mount it to be able to get to the switch without, you know, super gluing it to something. And so I leave it on and when I plug it in, you know, it's on, drive it, unplug it, it's off, all good to go. Problem is, is I ran it out in the yard after I ran this, and then we went to the track. I ran the Pegasus around the track, and then I went to run this and had a lot of issues with it. Um, it started getting glitchy. Um, it got out of range. It started, you know, going in reverse by itself. I didn't know what happened. And, you know, I turned it off. I turned it back on. It would work for a few seconds, and it just kept freaking out. I couldn't figure out what was going on until later on that evening I was laying in bed you know trying to go to sleep and my mind's running and I realized I left the Pegasus on and they're both bound to the same radio so at some point the Pegasus was closer to the radio so when this got further away it started getting glitchy I believe now that could be because I used the knockoff spectrum receivers in here I don't know I've never had this problem before because normally I just turn them on and off but in this case the Pegasus is on and this one um, was on at the same time and caused some issues so what I'm gonna do is we're gonna take this guy back out finish off the run around the track try to get in some good laps with it fingers crossed it works this time I'm pretty confident it will because you know the Pegasus is somewhere back there with the battery out of it so sorry about kind of breaking back in and giving you more information i know everybody wants to see the run video so i will shut up we'll go out there and run it and now you guys be happy be healthy be safe and i'll catch you on the next one see you guys